In other news, Purdue NDOT and Cummins Incorporated are celebrating the groundbreaking of the electric charging highway on US 231, known as a wireless power transfer project. It's the first of its kind. Several spoke yesterday to begin the nearly $11 million project. NDOT Commissioner Mike Smith, Purdue President Meng Chang, and representatives from Cummins and the Purdue team were all in attendance. The highway is built to charge electric heavy duty and passenger vehicles as they travel at highway speeds. It will start from Lindbergh Road and move westbound to Cumberland Avenue. Transmitter coils will be installed two inches below the road. The reason for the project is to reduce range anxiety and the size of car batteries for drivers. What this is attempting to do is try to get rid of that battery size, get rid of range anxiety to, by providing the power to vehicles as they're driving on a roadway. The test project is expected to finish in the summer of 2025. Cummins says they're looking into electric hybrid vehicles as part of their corporate initiative.